guys, today I'm going to be showing you my Animal Crossing Happy Home Design Town. It's really cute. I made it a while ago, and I kind of want to start over, but I don't want to lose everything that I've already made. So I want to keep this video as a little memory of what I have done in the past. Okay, so I'm outside. Obviously there's people here <laughs> trying to talk to me. But I guess we'll start here, because this is the first building. So this is the hospital. Alright, so here's like the little reception area, like the waiting room. As you can see, there's lots of little sick <laughs> people in here. I have to get past. Okay, and then in this door right here, let's walk through. So back here is the little area where the patients can rest in little hospital beds. As you can see, <laughs> someone is using one. And I just decorated it and separated it with little dividers so everyone can have their own private area. And then the TV is at the top. Each bed gets a TV. <laughs> and then I just put this little flower pot and I think it's a medicine cabinet just to make it look cute. So there's that. <laughs> oh my god, look, he's sitting in the chair. That's so cute. Okay, I'm gonna push past these people. Oh, you just shimmy. <laughs> Bye. To get to this other room. Oh, oh no. <laughs> get out of the way. Alright, in here. This is the little checkup room. <laughs> So there's a measuring scale so the patients can get weighed. There's a little desk over here with the little skeleton and x-rays. And the doctor right here <laughs> is checking on these little eagles. I don't know their names. I'm a fake fan. <laughs> um, but that's so cute. And yeah, I just designed it like a kind of all white themed, like a, like a hospital pretty much. Or like a doctor's office. So yeah, there's that. And it's so cute because in this game they actually dress up. Like there's a little nurse right here <laughs> to fit the theme of the, the building. So cute. <laughs> Love that. All right. So the next one over here, it's really cute. <laughs> it's the school. So I went with like the brick outside. I really like it. It looks really natural, like a real school. I'm going to go inside. Okay, so obviously this is the hallway. So I made lockers that lined the halls, kind of like a high school. And then at the top, I just added little flags for like school pride. <laughs> and then there's an exit sign. I think we'll start with the room right here on the left. Oh, and there's a water fountain here too. <laughs> All right, let's see what's inside. Oh, you have to be quiet. <laughs> there's a class in, in progress. All right, so he's up here teaching. As you can see, it's basically like your average classroom setup. The desks here and the, the double seats for partners. I just added little bits on the tables and stuff, like books, backpack, coffee, just, you know, your average stuff, <laughs> someone's sleeping in class. And I added like the flu fluorescent lighting because schools have that, and then a recycling bin, the bookshelves at the back for all the textbooks and knowledge and just potted plants and stuff for, you know, decoration. I, I would assume this is a science classroom because there's lots of biology and stuff happening with these mannequins. And the little teacher area is cute. There's a computer, a bulletin board, a little coffee cup. It's adorable. I'm gonna sit down. I love the dialogue. It's like so in in fit with like the setting and stuff. Please don't call me the same. Cheddar cheese. <laughs> Cute. 
All right, let's go to the next room. Oh yeah, I added this little umbrella rack for if it's raining one day and the kids can put their umbrellas in. So cute, okay, moving on. All right, so I'm gonna go down the hall to this other room. Can you guess what it's gonna be? <laughs> Surprise, it's another classroom. It's more like a lecture style. So there's just a bunch of chairs. <laughs> Stitches, oh, I love Goldie over here. So cute. There's a little pet fish in the back. Some more books. So I guess this is a geography class. Little earth globe right there. Rosie's the teacher, oh my God, so cute. <laughs> Her little glasses. All right, and then I don't know why she's sitting over here at the teacher desk, but she is for some reason. And there's the world map, a little chalkboard, some little cubbies. Oh, and then up on the wall, you can see at the top, there's a little intercom. Like a basic school, you know. I'm gonna sit next to Goldie and Stitches. It's so cute. Let's see what Stitches has to say about school. <laughs> Me. And then Rosie over here teaching. Let's see what she has to say. <laughs> Queen, we stand. All right, moving on. Next, we have this little sh this little cafe or bistro. Um. So yeah, it's basically a little coffee shop. So cute. So I have these little, I think they're called pine tables going on with little coffee cups. I liked this patterned carpet. And then this is where they, they check out the register. Here's the little cases of the pastries, the menu. And he's a little server. I'm going to talk to him. <laughs> Me at work. Yeah, this little back area with the coffee materials. And then the trash can over here. And then I put a ceiling fan in it because it's hot out and you need to cool down in the little coffee shop. Let's talk to a customer. <laughs> okay, impatient much. Stinky, we stand. Alright, so now I'm out here in front of the shopping center. So it's basically like a supermarket, shopping center, whatever you want to call it. There's a lot of people in here, <laughs> which makes it hard to move around. Um, but yeah, you, you can just browse the different items. Um, this person has a little shopping bag, that's adorable. There's some seating, because you know how in Walmart they have benches that you can sit in when you're done at the register? I don't know, I just felt like I'd put that there. There's a vending machine. And there's some flowers, if you need to buy flowers for someone, that's why I put some in the center. And there's um, the display cases with, with like ice cream and stuff in it. And the register, looks like no one is working the register right now, so I mean, I guess they could have a free-for-all in here. Because no one is even working at the store. Um, but let's talk to this guy. <laughs> that makes sense, great. So yeah, here's my little shopping center. All right, now I'm gonna cross the bridge over here to the theater. That's what it looks like on the outside. Very regal. So I kind of made it like a rock <laughs> with the like booth seating. Oh, there's a buzzer going off. Hell yeah, they're performing. So yeah, there's just the row, booth seating, kind of like at a movie theater. I put posters on the wall, like they could be albums or something. Here's the sound equipment, the stage. <laughs> Only one person is sitting down. Peanut. <laughs> Cute. So yeah, it's pretty much what it looks like. It's adorable. What is he saying? We love that. So yeah, 
There's that. Now crossing back over the bridge, I'm gonna go down here, down the little slope. And here is the fancy boutique. Okay, so when you come inside, everything is very elegant and rich looking with the chandeliers, <laughs> the people in their suits. Let's talk to them. Humble little store, yeah. Very classy. Lots of people here today. So I'm gonna go into this first room right here. So yeah, the theme is very dark, plush, with the, the furry carpet, and all of the items are very elegant taste with the, the mirror and the perfume, the vase. And then here's the little register area, of course. So you have to have some taste to be here, pretty much. <laughs> Talk to Fuchsia. Well, she said blue or red. There's literally only a pink one. <laughs> Spinning around. So yeah, very, very high fashion class, you know. So yeah, there's the first room. And then, oh my gosh, everyone's in the way. <laughs> Here's a little waiting area where you, you can sit when you know you're shopping too long, you need a break. Designed with like kind of orange themed, very very classy, I know I keep repeating myself. <laughs> and then the little desk where the receptionist will sit or whoever. All right, now going into this other room. It's kind of similar to the other one. Jesus, there's so many people. <laughs> All right, so yeah, there's like different displays or stuff you can buy like clothes. There's another vase, chandelier at the top. I'm trying to show you without Oh my gosh, everyone's in the way. Yeah, there's some makeup in the back, display cases, you know, plants, and then the cash register's right there, which no one is working at once again. Pretty much, that's it. And finally, I'm gonna take you guys upstairs. So it's this is the restaurant portion, I forgot to mention that. It's like a boutique with a restaurant up, up top. Very fancy, black tie. <laughs> And so, yeah, there's a menu right here in the cash register, which Chevra is doing right now. And there's just little tables for two. Oh, so cute. Just lining the room, very elegant, all the windows, and the chandelier. I'm gonna talk to them, they look fun. Cute. Let's talk to the waiter too. Water is so good. So, you know, you never have too much water. So yeah, there's that. Let me scooch it by. Fun. <laughs> Next door, here is the little office building. Low-key inspired by the office on Netflix, but not really. <laughs> it's just a regular office building. But yeah, let's go inside. All right, so starting off, here's a little receptionist desk. There's the, the coat rack, a little plant. Then over here is where people will work, their little desks. Bones is over here looking so cute. Some cabinets in the back, a printer, bulletin board. And over here, another cluster of desks, but there's there are three over here now. It's kind of a tight squeeze getting around. And then here's the seating area for guests that come into the office and the water cooler and coffee. Cause you know, early mornings be working on that grind and all that jazz. Let's talk to the receptionist. <laughs> I just love this stupid dialogue they have that like fits all the settings. All right, and let's go into the back room here. Oh, they're having a meeting. I don't want to disrupt. <laughs> So yeah, there's just a conference room, some seats lined up, some tables in case they want to add more space to collaborate. And then a whiteboard at the front with a clock and a potted plant. Just where all the meetings happen. I'm gonna take a seat here, listen in. Oh yeah, sounds very important. Yep, stocks and budget management, oh yeah.
That's an interesting proposal. I'm down. All right, yeah. So here's a little conference room. It's so cute. Okay, moving on. <laughs> oh, now Bones is doing reception. What has he got to say? <laughs> cute. All right, yeah, so that is my office building. Okay, next I have this really cute pink exterior. I think I made this a barber shop. We're gonna go inside and see. It's been a while since I played. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's like a hair salon, barber shop, whatever you wanna call it. So of course, here's the receptionist desk. I don't know, I guess there's a customer, but no one is here to ring her up. I'll do it. Boop, boop, boop. Okay, great. <laughs> and over here are just some display cases in case they wanna buy some clothes. And then they can get their hair done over here. We're gonna make over. <laughs> Pressed against the wall. Oh, Philbert. So cute. Oh my god, the, he's cutting his hair. That's so cute. Yeah, and then here's the dressing rooms. Fun. So you can try and close, order flowers, or get your hair cut. It's adorable. And that's the little barbershop boutique. Next, we have one of my favorites. It is the restaurant. It's very Japanese style, very cute, like a sushi place. I'm gonna go inside. All right, so up front here, obviously the cash register area, and then here's the dining area. Some big tables, lots of food. Lots of seating for everyone. So cute. I'm gonna sit down here. We can eat together on a little date. <laughs> num num num. I'm gonna talk to the wait staff over here. Pecan. <laughs> Me at work today. That's so cute. And then back here. This is where all the magic happens. It's the kitchen! So there's this island in the, in the middle that has all the food. Oh my god, I can't even get through. <laughs> there's the oven. Can I squeeze by? Nope. A bunch of different machines to use when, when cooking, you know. Ovens, dishwashers, fridge, there's a sink. All that jazz. Let's talk to her over here. That's right, fresh ingredients, better pizza, Papa John's, whatever. <laughs> so yeah, here's a little kitchen, pretty cute. They're all hard at work. I'm gonna talk to this guy. That sounds scary, but okay. <laughs> so yeah, here's the kitchen, yay, it's so cute. Okay, that was the end of the little restaurant. And I'm gonna go up here, and I love this building. So pretty, very regal. It's like a pink palace, like in Coraline. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'm gonna go inside, it's the hotel. All right, basic hotel lobby going on here. The umbrella rack, place to put your little shoes. <laughs> Front desk, it's also very classy. With the chandeliers with the jukebox, coffee. I love this one. It's so cute. Seating area. I put a little luggage here. Someone's like waiting to move in. This guy has a suitcase. <laughs> He's not even standing in the right line. But yeah, it's like refreshments. So fun. I'm gonna go into this room first. Also, I really love the flower painting. It's so cute, okay. So each of my rooms is a different theme. This one is the the elegant Rococo theme. Meringue is in here, I love meringue, she's so cute. <laughs> They're all cute, to be honest. So yeah, very Rococo, elegant, intricate. There's a harp, I'm gonna play it. Fun, I'm gonna talk to her. I 
love that. And then there's a TV here for fun, fun watches. You can watch whatever you want. Any saucy flick, meringue, wink, wink. So yeah, I really like this one. As you can see, I put the same flower painting over here. And there's some bonsai all around it. Very, very cute, very quaint. Perfect for one or two. Yeah, so there's the first room. I'm gonna walk through the lobby here. Oh, gonna get around everyone and enter the second room over here. So this one is very brown, very autumn, very like kind of, I want to say like log cabin maybe. It's like classical, very dark, like mahogany. Yeah, that's the right word. So yeah, same, oh, <laughs> he's sleeping. I didn't even realize. The same TV right here. Bookshelf, vanity, there's a ceiling fan. Just, you know, the brown classical kind of theme. I wonder if I can say anything to him. Oh. I guess he said that in his sleep somehow. So yeah, here's the second room. Next we have the upstairs. So the upstairs is really cute. It's also kind of a, a diner or a, a restaurant type style. So the hotel guests can come and eat. Here's a bellhop. <laughs> I don't know why he's up here. Yeah, it could be like an, ev an event room. And there's a live orchestra here, live music. Very classy, it's so cute. Yeah, there's the second floor of the hotel. Okay, so that's the hotel. And I think that's everything. I'm just gonna walk past the Nook store. So yeah, there's my town on Animal Crossing Happy Home Design. <laughs> it's gonna play the credits, I think, because I'm sitting. We don't have to watch it. <laughs> but yeah, that is the whole tour. Thank you so much for watching. I'm gonna run around super fast so you can see. I know I designed all this by myself. I'm a super cool interior design architect person. Just kidding. Um, I just like it. it. It all flows really well. And I haven't seen any other videos for a town tour because so I don't want to like copy anyone. So I haven't seen anyone else's. So if you play Animal Crossing and you have a town, I'd really like to see it. And if you want to send it to me or comment below, I'll watch it because I love watching Animal Crossing videos. <laughs> I also have Animal Crossing Pocket Camp. If you guys want to play with me, you can add me. I'll probably put it in the description somewhere or whatever. So yeah, that's the end. I'm going to do a little pose here. Let's see. I like this one. <laughs> Just have a great day and thanks for watching. Bye.